Hello there. England have suffered a heavy defeat to India in the second test at Lords. India declared on 298 for eight, but not before Mohammed Shami's spectacular half century from just 57 balls. That left England needing an unlikely 259 to win. England really needed a good start to their second innings, but they got the opposite in spectacular fashion. Rory Burns went for a duck after just three deliveries. And incredibly, Dom Sibley was then dismissed for another duck. For the first time in English Test history, they'd lost both their openers within the first 10 balls. In fact, it was also the first time two England batsmen had gone for naught. After losing Hasib Hamid for nine and Johnny Bairstow for two, things looked grim when Captain Joe Root went for 33 just before tea. The writing was on the wall when two quick wickets fell in succession, that of Moeen Ali and then Sam Curran, both off the bowling of Mohamed Siraj. Even though Butler and Ollie Robinson spent nearly an hour at the crease, the inevitable happened. Mark Wood and Jimmy Anderson were the last men standing. With nine overs to hold on, both went for no runs. Five ducks in one poor innings that led to a 151-run win for India, who take this series 1-0 lead. England are now without a win in seven tests. England's Sophia Dunkley scored an unbeaten 58 as Southern Brave beat the Oval Invincibles in what could be a preview of the women's 100 final. This six helped her to a half-century en route to a 116-run win. The Brave have already guaranteed their place in the final at Lords, while the Invincibles have secured a spot in the Eliminator. Oval Invincibles men are out of the competition. They were beaten by the Southern Brave, with Alex Davies scoring the winning runs with this six. He hit 40 off 29 balls to secure their spot in the knockout stage. Now to a scary incident at the Lingfield race meeting. Hayley Turner saved a fellow jockey from a potentially serious injury. Keep your eyes on the right of the screen. Apprentice jockey Hannah Fraser was preparing for just her 11th race when her horse Critique tried to duck under the stalls to break free. Turner quickly responded, pulling Fraser across to her side so she was clear of the horse, with a stalls hander also assisting as Critique broke free. Fraser was unheard. And forget about Love Island. What about this for an awkward moment? The one place you don't want to bump into your ex is live on television. Mark Allen and Rhianne Evans are playing each other for the first time at the British Open tonight. Their match comes four months after Allen reportedly asked for Rhianne to be withdrawn from a TV studio during the World Championships. But the pair split acrimoniously 13 years ago. There's more on all of those stories, plus news of a potential swap deal involving Arsenal's captain and Barcelona on Sky Sports News. We're back later.